My dear friends in Christ Jesus, greetings to you all. Today, I want to share with you the differences between the Latin and Oriental codes of canon law. My dear friends, when St. Pope John Paul II promulgated the code of canon law for the Oriental churches in 1990, he referred to the two codes, Latin code and Oriental code, as two lines for the same body. Many of the individual canons of these two, two codes are similar, or in some cases even the same, but there are some significant differences. Although Pope Francis and his predecessors have made some amendments to remove the differences between the two codes, still there exist some key differences. For example, a godparent cannot marry a godchild according to the Oriental Code. whereas there is no such prohibition in the latin code another good example of the difference between the two is found in the discipline of celibacy for priests in the oriental church a priest may be married whereas in the latin church a priest must remain celibate unless he receives a special dispensation from the holy father there are also a few structural differences between the latin code and oriental code the latin code is divided into seven books whereas the oriental code is divided into 30 titles and also the latin code is much longer than the oriental code the latin code has 1752 canons whereas the oriental code has 1546 canons Also, the terminology of these two codes often differs to account for the different spiritual patrimonies. My dear friends, the Latin code treats the Oriental Catholic brethren as members of the rites. In other words, the Oriental Catholics are seen as an extension of the Latin Catholic Church, but with slightly different liturgies and customs. and in some parts of the world their own hierarchy whereas the 1990 code of canon law of the oriental churches uses the expression sui iuris churches that is to say churches of their own authority and thus it recognizes that eastern catholics belong to their own churches each with its own distinctive spiritual patrimony that exist in full communion with Rome and the Latin Church together these two churches that is Latin and Oriental Catholic Churches make up the universal church one catholic church thank you for watching and listening may god bless you all